guys david miller here with gemini bim just want to share with you guys a quick method for duplicating sheets that already have views on them so this will duplicate the sheet and duplicate the views on the sheet uh, we'll be using dynamo for this example and let's just jump right into it let me open up the actual graph and let me walk you through it real quick. So if you wanted to recreate this graph on your own, you can. If not, I will try to have this graph available for download. Just look into the description of the video. So I designed it to be used with Dynamo Player and that's how we'll actually run it. But I just want to open up the actual graph and walk you guys through it real fast. We have a couple inputs here. Um, an image for our logo, uh, sheets, collecting the sheets and uh, making a method for us to be able to select the physical sheets that we want to duplicate. A duplicate option, whether we're gonna duplicate with detailing or not, and add a prefix and or a suffix to the newly created sheets and duplicated views. We're using data shapes to drive the user form for the selections and uh, allowing a, a nice user interface for the users and then bimorph nodes is the main component of what we're using to actually duplicate the sheets and views and place everything on to those newly created sheets so let's close out of this and I just have a sample project here uh, it, come, it comes with auto desk Revit um, and we have a couple sheets and uh, for floor plans and a sheet for sections so nothing nothing super going on here but it will serve the purpose as an example so to actually run this we'll use Dynamo player we'll go ahead and run it And we come up with the user interface here where we can select um, a single sheet, multiple sheets. We could select all the sheets. Then whether or not we want to duplicate with detailing, I have it to default to yes. And then a prefix or suffix that we can add to the views. And you have to add either prefix a suffix or a combination of both for the uh, graph to actually execute the command and then we can cancel if we wanted to and go ahead and duplicate the sheets and then depending on how many items you're trying to duplicate could be anywhere from a few seconds to a couple minutes but once the graph has completed then you'll notice in the project browser that you should see some new sheets created with the recently duplicated views and everything should match up. It's a really quick and efficient way to duplicate a series of drawings and it's really easy to deploy throughout the company so even the basic Revit user should be able to accomplish this. And there we are, here are our examples that we just uh, created. If we go to this, you can see that we basically created um, identical um, duplicates of the sheets. Now, of course, this will require further cleanup on your end, most likely logically naming these uh, sheets and views, and then if needed, uh, applying an appropriate view template. Now you could always take this Dynamo graph further to meet your needs and actually have it do those items. But I just wanted this to be a, a quick example uh, so that even a uh, novice Dynamo and uh, Revit user should be able to accomplish this. So until the next video guys, thanks for watching.